friends, welcome back to my channel and welcome if you're new here. My name is Jen, I'm a certified weight loss and nutrition coach and I'm on the WW Personal Points Plan. Happy Saturday, it is Saturday so it is grocery haul day. I did a Target and Walmart pickup it was not fun, but I did both pickups because I'm currently filming this the day before Thanksgiving. So of course it was a little bit hectic, but if you are excited to see this week's grocery haul, give this video a big, huge thumbs up. And if you're new or you haven't yet subscribed, I would love to have you here. Hit the subscribe button and click the bell right next to it so you never miss a single video. I do a grocery haul every single Saturday. Check out that description box down below for my brand new 2022 calendar. It is the only calendar you will need for the new year. Track your life, self-care, water, activity, your food, and even track your monthly goals. So definitely check that out. Grab it while you can because it is limited edition. You'll also find on my nutrition coaching website, all four recipe eBooks, personalized macros and calories, as well as one-on-one -on -one coaching. If you would like to chat with me directly links, discounts to all my favorite things. And don't forget to come on over. Join us on Facebook is also down in that description box. So let's jump into this week's grocery haul. So here's my grocery haul for the week. I did both a Walmart pickup and Target pickup. I'm currently filming this on Wednesday, the day before Thanksgiving. And let me just tell you, I had to wait 40 minutes at Walmart for my order. So I'm glad that I didn't go in store because the parking lot was crazy. So let me show you what I picked up for the week from both Walmart and Target. And then I'll share with you what I'm making for dinners and what you guys will be seeing on Monday for meal prep. My monthly Costco stock up trip isn't until next week and I was afraid that we were going to run out of both paper towels and toilet paper. So I went ahead and ordered them just to be on the safe side. Troy's having breakfast burritos for his lunches this next week. So I went ahead and picked up some real bacon bits. This is just going to save me some time. I'll pop these in his little breakfast burrito. Some minced garlic because I am making garlic butter glaze for my turkey for Thanksgiving. It's a recipe I found online and it sounds so good and it called for minced garlic and I don't have any. I usually just use fresh garlic. A honey ham. This is for a dinner recipe. I'm going to be doing a crock pot ham dinner and I'm really excited about this and this one looks so good. My favorite eggs, the happy egg. As you guys know, we're just about out of eggs and I need this for several recipes this next week. A pound of 96% extra lean ground beef. This is for a dinner recipe. Mild Italian sausage for Troy's breakfast burritos. I'm going to do sausage, bacon, egg, and cheese burritos. Now I did not order this, but somehow I was given this big pack of chicken breast. I actually ordered this a small pack of chicken thighs and they substituted for the big pack because they were out of the small pack. But I definitely didn't order the chicken breast. Now, I don't know if I was charged for it. It really doesn't matter. But that was interesting. I opened it up and saw thighs and chicken breast, which I know for sure I didn't order. At least I didn't mean to order. A big pack of center cut bacon. This is a four couple of different recipes. And then as I mentioned before, we like to just cook up the entire pack. And then we have crispy pre-cooked bacon on hand. I ordered the eight count of the Walmart brand of tortillas. They substituted for the 16 count of the mission. So we'll definitely use these or Troy will use these, I should say. These are for his breakfast burritos. A pound of extra lean ground chicken for a dinner recipe. I ordered two cans of pinto beans. I need those for a recipe as well as some fire roasted diced tomatoes. The turkey recipe recipe that I'm making said you have to use an oven bag, which I didn't have. So I went ahead and just picked up the two pack. That will have an extra bag for next year. Lasagna noodles. I am making a lasagna roll up. I'm so excited for it. It's a Alfredo lasagna roll up for dinner this next week. Two laundry scent boosters. The Lush from Downey is so good. And then we love the clean cotton. So I grabbed those. I'm hoping that Costco has theirs on sale and I'll pick up another one when I do my shopping there next week. A carton of chicken broth and a carton of beef broth. I need this for a couple of different dinner recipes. And then I did two boxes of stovetop cornbread stuffing for Thanksgiving. Now I don't care about stuffing. My mom doesn't care about stuffing, but Troy really wanted stuffing. So I went ahead and just added a couple boxes to my order. Some light shredded cheese for recipes. And then I did the sharp 
cheddar for Troy's burritos. I thought that would give a little bit more of that cheesy taste to the breakfast burrito. Some whole milk for a couple of dinner recipes, and then two packs of the one third less fat Philadelphia. I actually ordered the two pack and they substituted for two individual packs, which is just fine. That is for my meal prep. Low fat ricotta cheese. This is for those lasagna roll ups. And if you didn't know, I'm going to give you some valuable information. Walmart sells pre pulled rotisserie chicken and this is just the white meat. It just makes it really easy if you need rotisserie chicken, which I do for a recipe. I think it's about $9 and it's pre-pulled, pre-cooked, ready to go. Also some teensy tiny little ocean scented garbage bags. Troy takes these for garbage in his work truck every day. And in Washington now we have to pay for bags. So I just buy these and then we save the bags we pay for for our garbage cans in our bathroom. I also grabbed some deli ham because I needed some ham for a couple of recipes, including my lunch meal prep. And then for produce, I have a couple of organic zucchinis, a green bell pepper, shallots, the lemon is for my turkey, one big huge sweet potato for a dinner recipe, and lots of garlic. This three pack is for the turkey, and then I was almost out of garlic for myself. I also picked up a big case of Diet Coke and Coors Light per usual for Troy, but that is everything that I picked up for the week. Like I said, next week is Costco, my big stock up haul, so stay tuned for that. Now let's go ahead and jump into what I'm doing for dinners and the really exciting recipes you'll be seeing on Monday for meal prep. So here is what is on my menu for dinners for the week of November 27th through December 3rd. I can't believe it's almost December. So today, Saturday, we are going out for dinner. Sunday is going to be bacon cheeseburger chili. I'm really excited for this recipe. You guys will see this in Wednesday's What I Eat in a Day. Monday, I'm doing a slow cooker honey garlic ham. Tuesday is always a leftover night. Wednesday, I'm doing an autumn sheet pan dinner. This is lots of veggies and potatoes roasted up on a sheet pan. Thursday is chicken Alfredo lasagna roll-ups. Really excited for that. And then Friday, we always try to eat up all of the leftovers from earlier in the week. And here's what you'll be seeing for meal prep on Monday. For breakfast, I'm making ham and cheese egg cups. These are a spin on a traditional egg cup and I'm pretty excited about it. Lunch is going to be chicken Romano meatballs. I love a good meatball for lunch. It's just so easy. They last all week in the fridge, so I'm excited for that. And then for a snack, I'm making mini caramel apple cheesecakes. Tis the season for caramel apples. I'm really excited for that as well. So stay tuned on Monday for all three of these recipes. Thank you for joining me on another weekly WW Grocery Haul. I hope you enjoyed seeing all the good stuff that I picked up for the week, what I'm doing for dinners, and of course what you'll be seeing on Monday for meal prep. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to give it a big huge thumbs up. And if you're new or you haven't yet subscribed, I would love to have you here. Hit the subscribe button, click the bell next to it so you never miss a single video. Don't forget to check out the description box for the 2022 calendar, all four recipe ebooks, nutrition coaching, and don't forget to come over and join us on Facebook. Happy Saturday, friends, and I'll see you all in tomorrow's video. Bye!